Hey, what's going on, guys? Let's try this problem right here. Here, this question is asking a thin circular disc of radius 30 cm is oriented in the YC plane with its center at the origin. The disc carries a total charge of 3 microcoulomb distributed uniformly over its surface. Calculate the magnitude of the electric field due to the disc at point x is equal to 15 cm along the x axis. So, here they are asking to find the electric field due to the charged disc at a point. And this can be calculated using this equation E of x is equal to 2 phi k sigma times 1 minus x over square root of x square plus r square. Now, here the sigma is charge density and x is the point distance, and that's given right here that is 15 centimeter, and also the r is the radius of the disk that is 30 centimeter. And uh, that's it. Now we have to find out what is the sigma values. To find out, we use this equation that is sigma is equivalent to Q over area. Right here, the, we are dealing with the area of the circle, and Q is the charge that's provided 3 microcoulomb. Right, 3 microcoulomb in 3 times 10 to the power minus 6 coulomb, and the area of the disk is going to be phi r square, 5 times the radius is. 30 centimeter in meter that's going to be just 0 0.3 square and if you calculate this one you should get 1.061 times 10 to the power of minus 5 coulombs per meter square so this is our charge density now we can go ahead and plug it in this equation to find our final answer therefore e of x is going to be equal to 2 phi times k is 9 times 10 to the power of 9 times the sigma value we just figured it out that is 1.061 times 10 to the power of minus 5 and then 1 minus the point distance is 15 centimeter and in meter that's going to be 0 0.15 square root of 0 0.15 square plus the radius of the disk is 0. 3 in meter 30 centimeter 0 0.3 in meter square and that's it and if you calculate this one you should get 3.31 times 10 to the power of 5 newton per coulomb and that's how we do this kind of problems i hope this helps thanks for watching